Here in Back in the South, uh, we ran out of ideas pretty quickly, and we think that this will be good. Daisy of Love. <laughs> 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 Daisy, I just wanted to be happy. Oh, right. So she's very sad. Right. London left. Last night was the hardest elimination yet for me. I offered a chain to London, and he freaking broke my heart and left. Asshole! <sighs> I can't believe that motherfucker. It's fucking unfair to all of us, dude. Why? The rest of us just feel like shit just because we could all see firsthand how much she cared about London. All of our connections felt like they really didn't mean too much at that point. I'd feel that way about it too. Like, she was so upset about that one guy that left, and it's like, well, maybe we're not doing as well as we thought we were. Worth anything? Right. Yeah. No, you wake me up all the time in the morning. You talk so loud. Chi Chi's used to his naps. I was trying to sleep and the guys were in the room talking and I was getting aggravated. I said a couple things. I didn't say How shit. How did I wake you up? I already told you, dude. You woke me up by being fucking loud when you woke up talking all loud, dude. I told you. I'm gonna keep talking all the whole fucking time then, too. Ah. What the fuck are you trying to pick a fight with me right now, Chi Chi? Like, I'm serious? Now probably is not the best time to pick a fight with all me. All I said is... All I'm saying is right now is not the best time to fucking pick a fight with me. That's all I'm trying to say. I definitely think Cage has got some anger problems. Everyone's pissed at London, but... This. The professional fighter? Saying that right fucking now is not the fucking time to fuck with me. You think I'm fucking with you? Hey, bro, his bunk bed. <laughs> then I punched a teddy bear. You want me to fucking do it to you? Why? Would, can huh? I have my bandana? Huh? Can I have my bandana? Swear to God. Swear to Swear God, to God what, dude? Here, dude? Go take a Valium or something. You know, me being a fighter and stuff, I'm used to... Chichi's trying to sleep <laughs> in the daytime. Chichi, duerme. <laughs> I haven't won a date with Daisy yet, so I get up and I make some coffee and I got some fig newtons, which she told me that. I think he, I think I saw him on a very recent, I'm talking like a month ago, uh, MMA show. And he, he's actually fighting in MMA. Oh, is he? Yeah, and he looked good. Right. A little bit of Fig Newtons. Thank you. <laughs> Big Rig is adorable. He knows I'm upset, and he made me feel like, finally, someone around here besides Ricky cares about me. Ricky doesn't care about me. <laughs> but Ricky's like, if she dies, do I take over? <laughs> if she dies, do I have to go out with them? Because <laughs> I will. I need Yeah, I will. Well, I need this money. Big Rig really MTV doesn't show videos anymore. What am I gonna do? I got nowhere else to go. Maybe it's a good thing that he left because now I can actually focus on Ooh. guys who aren't gonna break my heart. Listen, what? you don't know that. <laughs> no one's here for love. Thank you Lovely so time. much for bringing me coffee. Now get out. Come on in. Oh my God, Chi Chi. He took his nap. Your own photo shoot. Jeez, dude, it's like we're all doing a photo shoot. I, I fight for a living, you know what I mean? I'm not feeling confident about it. And you know what the subject of the photo shoot is? You guys are going to be shooting me for the cover of my single. Pretty messed up. I'd rather not. I absolutely love what? photo shoots. I love playing dress up and of course, I Let's give a meathead a camera and see what happens. Mm -hmm. Presented with a copy of Pretty You know it's a professional we'll skill, not just a thing that you can do. No, no, we'll, we'll bang it out. Right. Daisy's song. We're gonna give you a CD of the song and the lyrics so you know exactly where Daisy's coming You don't from. need any of that. They don't need no. anything. Teams of four. You guys will shoot the photograph. You're We're gonna play the song a bunch in this episode so that Davy, Daisy gets royalties from the episode because she's gonna need that money after the show is over. Savage animal. <laughs> Savage animal. You hear that? Rolls off the tongue. Watch Supergroup. New York City. And like he walked down in that outfit today and I was just, my heartburn act. <laughs> it's like Edward Scissorhands. Nah, I did a kick there. Panic Panic, who have provided hair extensions, makeup, eyelashes, everything you need. We're gonna be the judges, but we've also enlisted the talents of another judge. Her name is Brie Crystal Clark. 
Brie is a world-renowned rock photographer. She has shot Ozzy Osbourne, ACDC, Radiohead. She's the real deal. Does Fox even know what's happening right now? The no. guy's completely checked out. She's like, so who gets the camera? And Kate. I wonder how my hair looks. They're gonna take pictures of me. Sinister, Fox, Flex. I'm super excited because I did my own album cover with my band and stuff. So is that a scarf? What is that? Covers than me. Sinister. <laughs> VH1. <laughs> That's a play on Frampton Comes Alive. Ah. Can you snap a picture? I can snap a picture. All right, he oh, can yeah, snap you a picture. Can, can you do hair and makeup? <laughs> oh, oh. I say he's the. Okay, quick, quickly. What's a good idea for Daisy's debut album picture, whatever, that they could pull off? I don't have an idea, but let me put it to the audience that I bet oh. Chris has thought about this for five seconds and has a pretty good idea. Let's hear it. You, you wanna hear my idea? Yeah. I don't have one. I'm so uninspired by her music and the idea of her music that I don't, my brain doesn't wanna come up with anything right now. Okay, so imagine that it's not her. Okay. And it's not her music. <laughs> okay. It's just a human being that needs to have a photograph taken to uh -huh. promote something. It's singing, I know it's singing. It's her though. Uh, I'm, I seriously, I, I, I can't do it. And That's I, something that a lot of people don't understand about creative professions is sometimes you have to be creative about something you care absolutely nothing, nothing about. about. Yeah, a lot of the time. <laughs> right. That's the hard part, that's the creative part. Yeah, I used to work in corporate video and they were like, come on Kyle, we want you to get excited about cutting this together. And I'm like, you won't even tell me what it's about. You won't take five minutes to tell me what this is about. Um, <laughs> And yet you want me to, to razzle dazzle it. Razzle dazzle. Okay. You go with that. Okay. Okay. He's in a model with her, bro. Just do a pinup. Just do a pinup with her. Model with her? No, don't do that. That's what Fox thought. I thought, I'm in a model. <laughs> yeah, because I'm a model. I mean, you do hair for a living. Uh, why don't you do, do her hair? Modeling to uh, the better looking guy. Uh, we haven't even talked about what he's doing. What else? Being the art director, which is a perfect job for me, 6 case, we'll let him be the photographer. You got to point and shoot. And I think that 6K can do that. Pretty messed up. Let's go read the lyrics. It says something. About I still can't come up with anything. Living in a world of make believe, glamorized silver self deceit, finding love on the silver screen. Right. Silver screen means like a 50s, like pinup doll type. Do this, do it. Okay, well, I don't care. My job is wardrobe, so, so no one can so even. Go ahead, bro. So we get an hour to accomplish everything. <laughs> I'm really tough. stressed out now. It's like we need to find the most build. 80s spot in this whole house. I woke up on the wrong side of the bunk bed. Perfect. So let's move this stuff out of the way. Can I have my bandana back? <laughs> The answer was no. <laughs> no. So much help Come and I get it. Wait for him to do hair and makeup. We hook up the bar and you guys are having a badass uh, time. And she lays on the bar in that blanket and you're back there like laughing. No, it's not. Fuck with your cavassier. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. Okay, guys, that's it. Everybody, stop your work. Come on in here right now. Time is up. You have one hour to work with Daisy. I still don't have anything. Some people to help you out. Brie has brought some of her photo assistants. That picture back there is fine. It's fine. Just use that. Shove it, shove it up everywhere. It's a cartoon. <laughs> oh, okay, he's being, he's in the, I was like, why is he wearing that like that? But they're both, they're, everyone's ridiculous looking. Right. Eyelashes, how the hairstyle would be, and what kind of makeup Daisy would be wearing today. I think we have a really good chance of making this. Oh wow, you look amazing. Yeah, thank you very much. I don't think so. He comes out. <sighs> Holy shit. Who wants to see a dude with her? Like it does, no. No. Beauty queen. No, she doesn't look good. She blends in with the background. This is all wrong. Daisy up like a little Marilyn Monroe. You know, she's looking sexy as ever. You know, everything's kind of really good. Is this her singing where she's just talking? Oh, is that it? Is in her fucking face. 12 pack. What? Fucking move. <gasps> yep, perfect. It's a 12 pack shoot. Oh man, I love to model and having the chance to get in front of the camera, it's only gonna improve my chances of winning. No, see that her lipstick's on her chin now. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah, it is. Look. Where's my makeup artist? Is it good? You're beautiful, babe. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even look. Yeah, you look great. Stand there and make out with her. It was just really fucking frustrating. 
keeps snapping, bro. <laughs> I'm sitting down here. Yeah, it's a show where a bunch of beefcakes watch other beefcakes make out with the girlfriend. Fucking come down Daisy's mouth. All right, I'm done. I don't like it. Fuck, I mean, I'm tired of looking at this shit, so. But this is our time to take pictures, you know? <laughs> I didn't even give a fuck no more. I'm on my break. Right Titi's like, I disagree, but I don't want to say that I disagree. I'm on my break. Union rules. Pictures, and I'm tired of looking at that shit, so. But this is our time to take pictures. You know? <laughs> yeah. I'm on my right now. <laughs> What's going on? Big <laughs> throws the towel in because 12 Pack was making out with Daisy the whole time. But um, I was focused on the challenge and I blocked that out of my mind just for the job. Hey guys, um, time is up, here's the deal. You guys are gonna get to go through the photos, pick the one. Okay, I finally have an idea. It's not a good one. Okay. So it would be. It's better than this already. Yeah, it is. So it would be <laughs> yeah, an extreme close up, and it would be her biting the lip of like 12 pack. Uh -huh. You'd only see like this much. Right. And it, she'd be pulling it back, and it's show, it'd be the title of her album or the song or Daisy uh -huh. or some shit. Like he tattooed it on uh -huh. inside, and she's biting his lip while they're kissing and pulling it back so you can uh -huh. see it. That's all I got. I like it. We get to decide which one of these photos we're gonna pick. That's cool, Mark. That. That's cool. I hate those pictures. Oh, wow. She looks great in that. He needs to be bokeh out. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Is that he should be like the the focus should be super shallow, so you can only see her, yes. and he's kind of fuzzy behind or something. Yeah, like that. he's a representation of a man. Right. One hour. And so the vision of our photo is punk rock, badass, beautiful disaster. Daisy. We're going for more of the heroin yeah. look. So, so that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. The thing is, is I'm a hairstylist. I mean, I cut hair. So I tell. Those are two different things. <laughs> Leave immediately. I can definitely take him in a haircutting contest. I'm gonna apply a little pressure. I'm so sorry, Joel. I'm okay. so sorry. Honey. Maybe a kiss can make up for it. Absolutely. Fox is being super attentive and making me feel really sexy. And for once, it's not about him being sexy, it's about me being sexy. Finally. You guys, we gotta. <laughs> you guys ready to go on a date later? Time to eat Cheetos. Make some burritos. Daisy's new single and she's just making out with 12 pack the whole time. And Big Rick got mad, I got mad, we all got frustrated. We just fucking ruined the whole team morale. So, I mean, worst case scenario, you don't, you don't get one, I just got one. This motherfucker. Why do you think he's on the show? <laughs> You're all douchebags. <laughs> I'm thinking like this. It's like when they call each other whores. Right I know. Be badass standing in the back. I don't know what it is, but this team's vibe yeah. is a lot cooler than the other team's vibe. Yeah, I love that when you No look dudes you know in, in the shots. Couple, Shoot's going great. But at least his Connection face. Was there, the yeah, at least he's in the, but he, I don't know. Looks like Lady in the Tramp. We got this challenge in the bag. It's money. That's money, dude. Uh, Just click. <laughs> They're all out of focus. He doesn't know how to take it. Bam. Fox, being Fox, just starts spitting bullshit. Hold the guitar. Flex. This isn't my album cover. And everybody can smell it. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Move her hair a little bit. Get out of there. Can I just yeah. do one These picture the with her? These are the ones. <laughs> Wait, come here. What is happening? Fox decides he wants to jump in. On you don't match. Way. Your body type is significantly no smaller the than the other one. Right? Nobody look at the camera but her. Fox, really, look, don't look at the camera. Don't look at the camera. Don't look at the camera but her. Fox, he had no business jumping in the shot. And as far as I'm concerned, he ruined the photo shoot in that way. All right, guys, your time is up. Now what you've got to do is you talk about it, choose the photo. Make sure it looks hot. Now it's time to pick our picture. That right there. Okay. I got that. God, I mean, it's so old. There you go. Now, dude. What are you guys talking about, about, dude? Hey. Fox, can you just shut up for like two seconds, please? I'm like, dude, shut your fucking mouth. Stop trying to justify something you didn't even have anything to do with. I think that looks great. I disagree. Time is running out. Okay, no one asked you. It's time to take a look at the pictures. So let's start with Team Big Rig, Chi Chi, 12 Pack, and Cage. I see Team One's picture and I'm like, wow, I'm Daisy Monroe. 
I think it came together. Except, I think except he's in front of her. Face is missing. And did a great job. As far as the photograph. What shoes is he wearing? I hate those. I love, love Marilyn Monroe. The colors all blend very beautifully together, and I absolutely love the picture. Great. And I've got to say, I love that's nice. That went for mm -hmm. the Marilyn look is really mm -hmm. beautiful. Right. Who is Marilyn Monroe? <laughs> <laughs> right. He had to shout that. Mm -hmm. He had to shout his stupidity Holy out. Crap! What an idiot. Who's Einstein? <laughs> Team of Sinister, Fox, Flex, and Six Gauge. Let's bring that picture up. Damn it. Damn it. He, he can't be in there. I see the other team's picture. Too distracting. Shocked. This totally screams Daisy. We came pretty precise on how everything was supposed to be. I mean, knowing the fact that everything is in well proportion, I think it's dope. I mean, <laughs> it was the way it was supposed to come out. <laughs> Out. He's not that the bright. That take, I out. love it though. My brain like Shut relaxes when he talks. Right? Like, talk to <laughs> His thoughts are like a sedative to people who think. <laughs> yes. Daisy is just such a beautiful woman with a great body and great face, and I'm not seeing enough of your body. I gotta say, man, the other teams looks awesome. That's better. I don't know what's gonna happen. I really don't. All right. It's a more of a real photo than the other one. I guess so. But that's all over the place. But this is more. On the theme, oh, that's a pretty really, messed really, up. Really hard decision. It's not that hard. No, none of these things they say are hard. Are hard. Would be a great album cover for Pretty Messed Up. Daisy's. About I don't like that one, but it's better than that one. It's a better photo, but it's, it's a better, better way to advertise what's inside. What catches your eye and makes the most sense in a? I think the one on the right is great pop punk, and I think the one on the left is dinner jazz. Hollywood. It's like one of. Yeah, I guess so. What the fuck? Why is the skull? Okay. But the one thing. Skull. I just felt like. Because I like skulls. Energy between all all of the team working together which made me feel sort of like I don't you know I'm, I'm not feeling this one as much you know uh, my music is very pop punk rock and to me that screams bright loud messy colors I'm gonna go with team number two the picture with flex team sinister guys flexo we win Fox is on the winning I team. Knew that we were gonna have this one. I knew it. I had a great time. With <laughs> they like, shit, yeah. like a little kid. He's like, you did it. You rascal. MVP from the team, who I felt, in my opinion, really, you know, helped with a lot of, in a lot of aspects, to capture this picture. Do not say and, Fox. Um, that person is going to be Fox. <laughs> No way. They just do whatever the fuck they want me? on this show. It doesn't matter. And <laughs> where should I walk? He doesn't even know. Where should I walk? Where should I walk? It was a really hard do. decision. Where should I walk? Nowhere. Awesome. I'm definitely not. What do I do with my head? Fox really like made me feel awesome. He was very attentive to my needs. So she told me I win a solo date. I feel so awesome that I can be solo with her. Fox. Congratulations. Wow. I wouldn't be worried, guys. Special time with Daisy on the town. Thank you very much for putting all your <laughs> Chi Chi looks so mad. Um, go get ready for date. Well, his version of mad. Right. Oh. Very upset. Whoa, he knows tricks and stuff to. I made her feel. Of course he does. And it was all about her. You know, I'm a hairstylist. We do what we do. I don't know how much more of this I can take, man. Fox winning that MVP was like seeing London happen all over again. Dude, all you can do is give it all your all every single day, dude. My entire life, I've only cared about two other girls. So, this is way more real than I, I ever thought would be in it. Uh, I didn't understand anything that he's saying. All, all I can see is the scary. tattoos on his face. Tattoos on his face. It just screams, I have good judgment. Oh, I Whoa, my God. Wow. What's the cheapest thing we can do? Is this gonna be? You're gonna get naked. Sass. She should have worn that dress on the shoe. Yeah, right? It's different. It's personality. Totally made me feel like a goddess. Well, but yeah, never mind. Make him feel like a god. Very Olympic. Olympus like. Very thankful that. This is Greek cultural appropriation. <laughs> totally chat with you at one point. I'm, I'm here for you, and I'm here being me. I cool. feel like I'm the realest dude in here. I cut hair. <laughs> no. I cut hair. Exactly so I have <laughs> trouble 
coming up with like conversation stuff mm -hmm. in in real life sometimes this guy has more trouble than that yes uh in a lot of stuff not just conversations how did he even pick his tattoos like was he just like i want number eight and mm -hmm. number six because i like 68 are you looking for a relationship and if like what kind of girls do you normally go for it's about you know dating someone that that can you know be on your level and being like you know what, i'm going out tonight and then you're like okay then i'm going out too and then you're like in the back of your head you're like wow Oh my God. Okay. Well, I think that we're. Look, this what? isn't. I'm going out too. We're, we're amazing. We never claim to be a science channel. Or <laughs> we're not, we're not gonna <laughs> learn anything from us. I understand how you roll. We're not a Mozart reaction <laughs> channel. No, relax your brain. I just feel like we're having a missed connection for some reason. You know, and there's people that they're not, and there's people. <laughs> Daisy's like, I'm not used you to being the smartest like person <laughs> in the room. <laughs> you know, it's like, wow, that's really like, fucking stupid. Who would and who do you think wouldn't? When I'm with Daisy, I just I just look her in her eyes, and I automatically feel like. I can conversate, but at the same time, silent speaking. <laughs> I feel like there's a really good connection. <laughs> he, makes, he makes me feel better about I how I talk. Chemistry. He makes me feel a lot better about a lot of stuff I've done. Attraction. No. Attractionness. Way too good for just talking. I have an older brother. I have a younger what? brother. My older brother is. Uh, I think they need to do less of this and more of this. Oh. Ugh. When I kiss him, there's definitely It looks forced. It looks very forced. Connection. Yeah. So, hey, I guess it's not all that. She's not into him. Then why'd she pick him? Uh, Have fun. Uh, you won't pick him again. It's the most London that she could get in that moment. Right. What the fuck? <laughs> really? I'm so sorry. He just I'm kicked. Sorry. Dude, no, it, it came out wrong. Damn, he's certainly about this <laughs> Do you want to die? What? Right. He kicked that thing. Why is the Larkins? Hey, I am really not worried about Fox at all. No. Because the guy is just an idiot. He's got no brain in his head to play this game like I can, and he's going to screw himself out of the competition. However, I agree with 12 Buck or whatever. I don't want to know their names. Sausage Man. I hope I go to my death not knowing his name. 12 pack, 12 pack, 12 stop, pack. Stop, stop. <laughs> so I agree about Fox. Right. But does it not look like he's having a great time in life? Sure he is. Yeah, it's Why great. Why shouldn't he? I want no, I'm not. I think he should have the best time ever. But also, I don't think he's a better candidate for me to watch more of. Oh. I like this guy more than I like Fox. Oh, because... Fox, you could say, hey, man, you're a big, you know, you're a big idiot and stuff. And he can laugh it off and genuinely forget and then go have more fun. Yeah, but he's not s smart enough to do anything cl like clever. Yeah. And he's not, he's not like dumb enough to do something funny. Yeah, yeah. He is in that middle ground. Yeah, I just, it's just not that interesting. So I've had enough antics for the night and I run into Cage. What are you oh, doing? Right. No. Nothing. We were playing pool. Whoa, what are you saying? Are you okay? Yeah. I'm kind of curious to see what's going on with him because today... The producer told me to come in here. I We need to eliminate Cage and I got to find a reason. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm definitely putting a wall up right, right now. You know, like, I'm not going to continue to let my feelings get hurt and, and get walked on. You know, like, I'm a human being too. You know, just like she doesn't want to get hurt. I don't want to get hurt either. You're on a... With those slippers. I like those. On a show, on a joke that. of a show. Right. We're all having a little fun, a little alcohol involved. We're all hanging in the jacuzzi in our tidy whities getting drunk and a little crazy. Oh my God. <laughs> sinister. Not much sinister about that. Oh. That's a real skunk. Let's just go in the house like this. That is the same pool that uh, Joni and Adrian were in. Right. Yeah, this is real life. Oh, it got into the house. Oh shit! Oh shit! Don't get back! Again, this is the kind of entertainment that you should expect. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. So everyone's drinking and someone says skunk. So everyone thinks of the crocodile hunter at this point. <laughs> This, mate. Terrible idea. Don't get back! 
camera off, like I'm out of here. Oh, oh my god, that is a horrible stench. <laughs> no skunk is gonna come into my house and smell the place up, so I take the chair, I throw the chair into the corner. I got the skunk in the corner. Like Somebody put pants on. I picked that garbage can up and. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God! Oh my God! It's raining! Oh, I've got in his mouth. When a skunk sprays you, it like lets off this little, you know, mist. Thing. <laughs> like, oh man, that's terrible. But I couldn't mean, have him to a nicer guy. This is right on my face. Slow mo replay. It smelled like some demon just crawled out of hell and hooked onto my damn face. Oh, Give me a garbage. Kicking everybody's ass. <laughs> oh, that doesn't I, work. Go in the bathroom. I'm just over here just hurling. That doesn't work. No. Oh. He's puking. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, the show just got better. <laughs> Everybody's puking. Everybody's puking. I feel good. Now, this is entertainment. Throw up, dude. Watch out. You guys don't need Daisy, just introduce different animals in your house. Just a couple of skunks myself. Mix is an alligator. Oh, oh no. Um. Woo! Ah! Release to the wild. And the skunk got free. Don't go towards the house. Ugh. I think, you know, that, that skunk was a godsend. You know Pants. what I mean? Like, it was a really good distraction off, off all the bad things that was going on with me. And it just it was hilarious, dude. After that, like, I was happy. That's all you need is a skunk yeah. attack. The wild release the wild. How y'all like this? <laughs> Woo! Is that the end of the episode? Oh no, they need it. <laughs> yeah, there's an elimination. <laughs> Forgot, I Does that mean I have a date with her too? No. It's so okay. entertained with that. <laughs> I got a date today. Booyah! <laughs> Sinister look. <laughs> just sit around and smell the skunk, but I have a date today. He looks so sure funny time. and yeah. not funny. Ooh, look at him! Yeah, let's do this. <laughs> Miniature zebra. Wow. Yeah, right. Date lab. Yeah! Oh my god. We pull up to a skate lab. I thought it was a roller rink. So I was no. Really exciting. Woohoo! Oh wow. They don't call yeah, rinks labs. <laughs> now drop in. You gotta be fucking shitting me. <laughs> Aren't you glad you won this day? I used to skateboard all the time when I was a little kid. And I thought, what a great fun day this is. As an eight-year-old, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure the guys were impressed with my skateboarding skills. I mean, I really want to show her that I'm... Did you take her shoes off? Man, I'm kind of terrified. <laughs> Fucking rocking that shit. <laughs> oh, he should not really? be skating. Truly? No. He honestly. is way too big. 29 years old, I don't have time for kids to play. No butt party, man. Little kids do that. <laughs> when these guys said they've never skated before, they were not lying. No. Oh my God. No, you can't do that. Think about, and you don't have a wrist guard, oh. nothing? The future. That's a big, that, I would not do that. No. You know what? Fuck this. We're here to impress Daisy. I went to the biggest ramp they had in that bitch. <laughs> You're going to fall. He's going to fall. She's going to laugh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Not as bad, not as bad. Thanks for me. I ain't dropping in on this thing. Are you okay? I try. Are you okay? You Flex doesn't know how to skateboard, but I love that daredevil quality in him. That's oh, scary. oh my god, are you sure? <laughs> now he's gonna kill himself. Are you sure? it's a well, they're not even oh looking. The boo boo. I'm thinking four wheels, my big ass. Don't do it. Fuck that. You, do you see a ton of huge skaters? No. no. They die instantly when they fall. Anything. Oh my god, that's gross. <laughs> Six gauge isn't saying a whole lot. I want you to come with me for a second. I felt like I needed to confront Six Gage about do you like me or not. I feel like you maybe have sort of been a little distant or in the background or something like, I mean. I think some of the guys are immature and I, I'm not. I'm a very, I'm a little bit older and I, I'm a business guy. 
Well, business and real estate school and bartending. So I just like to make money financially. I take care of myself. Sure. Instead of explaining why he's been so distant, Six Gage starts to talk about his businessman skills, and I don't get it. Can I talk about my businessman skills right now? You should talk a lot about that all the time. I do business uh, in men. Skills? Seen what? Numbers? Oh, he showed it to me and I was like, You d he, he did? You seen. It's what? fucking you crazy. Kidding? If I have to be the aggressive type, then I guess it's time to uh, step it up a notch. You ready for it? What happened to being the mature right. business? Daisy takes one look at six gauge is six gauge, and the look on her face was like somebody just stepped on a baby rabbit. Oh my god. <laughs> I called Six Cage out for being distant, and apparently, this is how he chooses to step up his game. Is it a way to <laughs> pull out his dick? Nicely yep. done. Now that my eyes are showed his Six Cage. It's back to the house. Uh, classy. No, don't do that. This looks good. I mean, I definitely. <laughs> They get bored. Like right. Cooped up in the house. No TV, no phone. A lot of booze. Just gonna go ahead and relax and just. Yeah. Yeah, yeah amp and vodka. And drinks. Food oh, on me. Holy oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> yes, please. He's growing on me. Oh, Foss's laurel that he was wearing on his date yesterday. Hey, here, let me see that. This is what I gotta say about Foxes and Daisy's date. Yeah. Oh. Burning plastic? Yeah, great idea. Yeah. Oh my god. So next thing I know, Cage takes the laurel that's burning in the fire and holds it up in the air. Oh my god, you picked it up. Right now, six Dude, dude. Yeah, it's on fire, it's melting plastic. It's all chemicals. My skin is burning. Oh my god. Motherfucker, that burned his skin on my hand. Oh, it burned him? Look at my fucking hand. Shouldn't have touched it. He threw it on him when he asshole. Oh, me... oh wow! <laughs> it's so drunk. <laughs> See, he tried to grab it. Oh, off. you're right. Trying right. to tell him not to do it. Oh yeah, it's not gonna be pretty. My that fucking foot. skin is burning. What? what? No. One time, I'll let you punch me in the face. One time. Hey, hey, hey y'all, hear me? I consent to this. Cage is becoming a belligerent drunk. Mm -hmm. Ridiculous. This guy's trashed. This is horseshit. Flex, if you don't punch me in the face, you're not a real man. Flex, I said it. What you gonna do about it? We were just sitting around the fire, joking around, and uh. You put your hand in the pool, know, cool it off. Burned. But I don't give a shit, you know. Wait. No, I'm good. All right, eliminations. Let's do this. <laughs> I was drinking lot just because, you know, I was so stressed out, feeling like. It. Is, what, uh -oh. what is he? What's myself? And I felt kind of like uh. Right, bro. Who's ready for elimination tonight, fellas? <laughs> Cage is my boy, but come on, he's wasted right now. This could definitely get bad. I thought him and Chi Chi were or Sinister were boyfriends. I also thought that. Really, really? Uh, Keep talking shit, dude. Uh, really? I don't know why Cage thinks I'm going home. Nor do I give a fuck. Bro, you're going home anyway. So why don't you tell me what's up? Six Gage. <laughs> You're on your fucking mouth. Watch, watch how sober I get, bro. Watch how sober I get oh, on real shit. quick. Watch how. Thanks. Watch how. You barely moved him, by the way, when you pushed right. him as hard as you could. Yeah, I know. <laughs> grabbed me from behind. Usually guys I fall down when I do that. <laughs> Weight classes exist in MMA for a reason. He knew that. Oh my God, my dad, God. What is this? Fuck ass bitch. Stop, stop. stop. Let him go. Let him he ain't an ultimate fighter. Let fuck go. that. Let him go. He can Let fucking drown in this fucking headlock. Fuck that. I'll go home. Come on. Fuck it. I'll go home. I don't give a fuck. Does he have a rear naked? Created and I know what that is. And I'm qualified to say yes or no. You gotta let him go, dude. Oh, look, the production came in. The, the guy in the blue is production already. Oh. I was like, you know what? He is out of control. He needs to go home tonight. No, no, I'm gonna fuck him up, man. Fuck that kid. If other people hadn't have been there, it would have been real, real nasty. I should have known it was gonna happen. I should have known it was gonna happen. Okay, elimination, let's fight. Right. <laughs> While I was getting Who's here for love? The producers a bunch of drunk meatheads got violent. <laughs>
I can't even believe it. I don't believe it. This show has so many surprises. I need to talk to Cage right away and figure out what in the heck is going on. They're What's probably going to kick him off the show. I, I came down because I'm concerned. I but I had time to put my tiara thing on. Daisy came down and um, I'm a mess. I'm just so fucking frustrated with the whole thing. Yeah, I mean, he's all over it and now he's just yeah drinking as much as he can and yeah looks like he got punched yeah he's not very mature no this guy all i can think about is flex getting to flex how i can get to flex how i can make him pay for doing what he did to me you know you did burn his hand technically know, right? six to eight hours a day my whole fucking life it's what i know best <laughs> I do it better than anybody, dude. Like, I take... You don't do it better than it's anybody. It's easy for me, dude. Like, it's easy for me to fucking hurt people. It's real fucking easy for me. Like... I don't know what happened. I think it was just a misunderstanding because there's a lot of emotions. Okay, so, so I'll tell you what. That let, us, let us demic ourselves, go to the bottom of the hill, no cameras, see who walks back, and then that gets who's... That is who gets to stay. Let's just do it like that. Can we just do it like that? Yeah, he's completely gone. Right. Really hard for him to control his emotions. By the way, uh, like you made a joke, but MMA fighters are supposed to be really good in discipline with their feelings. Just like, just. Oh, yeah. Um, because they're professionals. Yeah, the worst ones are the ones that lose it and don't follow a game plan and don't check their heart rate and. You know, that kind of right. thing. Right, or get in a fight at the bar the night before and get in jail when they're supposed to be fighting on television. Listen, I can't understand listen, it, dude. I want you here, but listen, I need you to make a decision. The same as people that say, uh, you know, rock and roll is this, so let's just get right. wasted all the time. That's exactly it's right. It's like, no, dude. Oh, man, dude. He's still really drunk, too. Yeah. So are people just gonna keep getting kicked off the show and leaving the show, or? Well, it's a whole new way to, to structure We're the show. I don't lot, don't lot like it. Right. I look around and Cage ain't here. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, he's. These are yeah, he's wasted. He's done with this whole thing. I can't can't be in the same house with Flex anymore. <laughs> right. Because <laughs> he humiliated you. Because he overpowered you easily. Right. I couldn't give her the answer that she wanted because I didn't want to lie to her, and I and I, I really don't have uh, anything else to say. I just, just yeah, he, he he just it was too much for him, and he gave up, and yeah, the drinking and all that was just the way out. I have to make sure that this house is safe for all my guys. So. Yeah, sure. In the end, <laughs> fucking skunk came in. I know. <laughs> Ran a muck. Let him go. A muck, a muck, a muck. <sighs> She's faking or crying. She's like, she can't, cannot, she cannot come up with a tear right now. No. Think about London. <laughs> I don't think this is right, but you know what? You're awesome. She's like, please don't hit me. <laughs> you leave. I say goodbye, I have to let you go. Yeah. I really, really, really feel that Cage needs someone to help him with his emotions. It's called therapy. I truly hope that he gets that help because I know that there's a really sweet, awesome person in there. Yeah, I mean, he doesn't seem like an all bad dude. There does seem to be like a cool little guy in there, but it's clouded by a lot of- Alcohol and violence? Trauma and shit. Yeah, yeah, for sure. You gotta deal with all that. I'm sure it holds back his MMA game too. No, right. I'm not gonna be with, you know, the girl that I fought so hard to be here with and I just gotta walk out that door and Turn my back to everything. What was his name, Eric? That's a quick illumination. <clears throat> I <clears throat> had to walk someone out here that was so angry, he felt like he was gonna have to hurt someone tonight. When I hear those stupid words that came from violence, that's exactly how all men think of that. Right? I don't know. Okay. Violence. I grew up with violence in my own life. And that's not something that I condole. I mean, I hate to say it, Cage is my boy, man, but I think she made the right decision because there's no telling what Cage would do. I mean, he's a professional fighter. Like, he's dangerous. You can go, guys. Everybody stand tonight.
All right. Well, the way this one ended. Yeah. It's a new take on it. Days and days and oh. driving me crazy. Is, is she hallucinating? She's still in love with London. Why is there so much broken glass over here? I'm probably going home because fucking. Stop. Come on. <laughs> hey, ridiculous. Hey, bro, seriously, dude. Draw back. Let's show you how it works. He's such a little man. Like a... I know. You're I'm fine. The best air... What are they doing? <laughs> 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 wiping his head with the broken glass. It's the best air cut in here. It fits. Get him. Get him. Exactly. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> they could just do that for most of the show, and yeah, I, I right? would find it really funny. Yeah, I don't need any emotional context. No. I, just, I just want to see that, that for 22 great. More, minutes. More skunks. You know, it's a lot. It's a lot, and not everyone's set up for it. So no. uh, that was a crazy episode, and uh, we're going to keep going. We're going to finish Daisy of Love, and we're going to line up all these nice little playlists for all yeah. the bingers. Yeah. Like and subscribe. Right. Yeah. Dizzy of love, dizzy of love, la, la, la. <laughs> We have subscribers. People will see this in some form or another. <laughs> There's 6,100 people that are like, yes, more of this, please. <laughs> Would you guys shut up and show the show? <laughs> Keep saying, let's get the numbers down. <laughs> see what that feels like. I know I'm really, I'm really tough and, and you're scared of me, but... <laughs> Please like and subscribe. I know I'm really intimidating and everything, <laughs> but if you could just click that like button and show me, or else. Home of the alphas. <laughs>